As they beat Loyola here today by a count of 66 to 58. For the first time in more than two decades, Navy has earned the top seed in the Patriot League tournament. It's an unbelievable accomplishment. It's, um, it's not an easy thing to do. Winning is not easy. Um, you know, and we've, we've got a special group. You know, it's special. I've, I've never been a part of, of any championship team growing up. Um, it's my first championship ever, and it, it feels great. But like I said, I'm just we're all just focused right now on, on the Patriot League tournament. The Mids took care of business over the weekend against Loyola to clinch the top spot. But the kids just believed. They just believed. They never got nervous. Um, you know, just super proud of them. Minus two starters, the Mids relied on their depth. Nelson is there for the follow-up flush for the Mids. With Daniel Deaver, Greg Summers, and John Carter Jr. leading the way against the Greyhounds. I've been telling these guys all year that, that 2021 is the year of the Navy midshipmen. And um, and we just keep believing that. We keep loving on each other and supporting each other. And um, you know, it, it's just a really, really special thing. Yes, Following the victory, it was time to celebrate, but the work is not done yet. This is one of our goals at the beginning of the year. And the other one is, is to win that Patriot League tournament and get to the NCAA tournament. And as the number one seed in the Patriot League tournament, the road to Indianapolis heads through Alumni Hall. But this is, a, this is a great place for us. You know, we feel comfortable here. We've got a routine. The guys are comfortable in that routine. Not having to, not having to travel and sleep in your own bed, I think is really important. For Navy Sports, I'm Phil Bergman.